Okay, so I'm in the kitchen. Earth the Urban Chic is in the kitchen. And I'm doing a little um, vegan, vegetarian meal prep for my Thanksgiving because I don't eat meat. And so I'm trying to figure out what can I cook for Thanksgiving. And so for my first dish, it's going to be a wild grain rice dish. So over here in the pot, I have my rice simmering in the um, organic vegetable broth. And I'm about to saute these veggies which is portobello baby bella mushrooms with asparagus and some fresh garlic that I chopped up and I put the Goya total veggie seasoning on it in addition to some coarse ground black pepper and my Montreal steak seasoning and so right now before I put it into some heat to saute the veggies um, I don't think that I'm gonna need any olive oil but just in case I have it here to the side um, but usually in my experience when I'm doing sauteing my um, baby bella mushrooms they usually make their own juice and then the asparagus you know it's a fresh green veggie so I shouldn't use or need any olive oil and once I'm done sauteing those to my liking I'm going to add them into the rice because by then it'll be cooked up a little bit and then I'm gonna let it cook the rest of the ways in the rice in the veggie um, broth and then the pan over off to the side I'm going to pour the rice and veggie mixture into the pan and sprinkle it with the um, Italian cheese blend and let it bake for about 10 or 15 minutes maybe at like 350 380 degrees I don't think I need to put it in at um, 400 that might be too high and then um, let it cool and then I'm gonna enjoy it so yeah this will be a uh, dish number one of two or three dishes of meal prep because I have some fresh fruit when I went to the market they had pineapples some nice fresh juicy pineapples so I got two of those because they were like a dollar each and then I got my whole berry cranberry sauce I got two cans of those because I really really like that and then I got some sweet potatoes which I probably will either make sweet potato fries or cube them and bake them or I could just bake them whole and then put a little butter oh I did get me some vegan butter um and then you know put like a little cinnamon and nutmeg on top of the sweet potatoes because again I'm not trying to eat all that processed sugars and I don't eat meat anymore so I'm just trying to keep it healthy and simple and just make me something that I can enjoy um, and eat on for a couple of days because I can't partake or don't have a desire or will not be partaking in you know the quote unquote traditional um, Thanksgiving uh, meal preps. I am going to attempt to make a stuffing vegan style um, or vegetarian style um, when I get to that part I'll let you guys see so for right now I'm about to put these um, nice veggies I just wanted to you know mix them around a little bit in the seasonings that I put on it now I'm about to put them over the heat and saute them for about a few minutes and then add them into the rice like I said I was so I'll come back when I'm to the step where I'm adding it to the pan and when I'm about to put it in the oven and have the cheese sprinkled on top. Okay, so thank you for joining me as I cook. Again, this is vegan, vegetarian style cooking as I try to prep for um, a healthier version, alternative version for plant-based diet for um, Thanksgiving meal 2019. Earthy Over and Chic. Thank you for your likes, comment, 
for subscribing, for your continued support, sharing the videos, for your words of encouragement when you see me out in the streets. Um, and sometimes if you're my taste kitchen, thank you for supporting me by tasting my food and giving me honest reactions. But for the most part, people enjoy my cooking. So I appreciate that. But I doubt if I'd be sharing this outside of my own household because I am, you know, doing this for Thanksgiving. So, um, yeah. Okay, so Earthy Over and Chic signing off. Thanks.